When you apply for a loan, it's important to understand what you're getting into. Loan is another word for debt, or money you borrow and must repay. Debt equals loan. Loan equals debt. Different words that describe the same thing. If I apply for a $500 loan, then the principal is $500. That's the word for the amount borrowed in the first place. Now let's talk interest. The interest is how much it costs to take out the loan, on top of the principal you'll be paying back. The amount you pay for every dollar borrowed is expressed as a percentage rate. For example, 7% means 7 cents per dollar borrowed. The higher the interest rate, the more expensive the loan. Some loans are scheduled to be repaid over five months. Some loans are scheduled to be repaid over 30 years, like a mortgage or home loan. The loan term is the amount of time the lender schedules for repayment of the loan. That's it, let's try it out. Say you had a three-year loan of $5,000 and the interest rate was 5%. What would be the principal? $5,000, the amount of the debt. What rate is the interest? 5%. How long is the term? Three years. And if you pay $150 every month for three years, you'll end up paying $5,395 to the loan. $5,000 of that will be the principal that you borrow. $395 is the total interest paid. Not too tricky, right? When you repay a loan, you will usually make monthly or weekly payments. There are two things that you should know about each payment. One, payments will never be a surprise. Each payment that the lender requires will be communicated to you in advance of the due date so you can plan. And two, each payment includes a portion of interest and principal. What does all this mean for you? Usually, your payment will be due on the same date of each month. Still, it is your responsibility to watch your mail or email so that you know when your payments are due. Your lender will tell you how much you must pay so that by the end of the term, you have repaid your principal, including interest. If you want to pay your loan off faster, just pay more than the minimum payment your lender requires and you'll save yourself the interest costs. There are some more terms we will learn later on, but this is a good place to start. All right, let's see what you learned. Take a minute and complete the quick quiz to see what you know now about loan basics.